So it's the beginning of day two. All I have left to do is wire the little gauge I added and to install a camera. What I have left to do is heated grips, hand guards, and to install the jerry can and storage box. So I'm looking to grab a flat bar to go across these two points. So you can mount those right on there. OK, I can see what we have, and we'll go from there. OK. Thank you. Thank you. My hand guards that I ordered are white because the bike was going to be white and red. Now the bike's black, so we're trying to find some black ones, and we did find some black ones, but they are not for these mounts, so I'll maybe drill some holes for that. To... I have the lizard lights left to install and all the bodywork left to install. I wanted to get the bulk of the work done yesterday, and this is a little bit tedious, so I wanted to be fresh in the morning to do it. We didn't get enough lights from the order, so we had to run out last night and grab some more lights from somewhere. And uh, the amplifier and the speakers took a lot longer than I had anticipated on the 2019 model. So that was a little bit of a challenge. Day one went a lot faster than I expected it to. I got through a mirror, um, hand guards, and exhaust, and two tires. All I have left to do today is uh, install the chain. I'm really excited to uh, fire up the bike later today and uh, hear what the exhaust sounds like. During day one, I encountered a couple of problems. The clutch cable was one of them. It just ended up just a simple reroute and it ended up being fine. The surprise you guys did for us uh, with the color, I think it might be starting to grow on me, so it's not together and done yet, so I haven't decided if it's coming off or staying on. The battery is in a unique spot on this bike, so there's some panels that have to come off. It's actually under the gas tank, so that'll be a little bit time consuming. Wow, looks fantastic. Great job. So what have you exactly have you done for this? Took the swing arm off, put the track kit on, moved the front wheel, put the ski on. We put uh, heated grips, a relay to run the heated grips so when the bike's on, they're on, and when they're off, they're off so you don't drain your battery. Why 450L for this type of build? The 450L, it's close to the CRF chassis, and it has a higher output stator, so it will be able to run the heated grips, and it comes with a headlight. Plus the thermostat, that's an extra expense with the other bikes, is no thermostat, you gotta put the thermostat so you can keep the right, engine right. temperature up. Can't wait to try one. <laughs> yeah, they're a lot of fun. Great job. Yeah, Good thank luck. you. Take care. You too. Hey Scott, how's it going? Hey Larry, how you doing? Keeping well? Yeah, what do you think? Bike looks fantastic. How's the build going so far? I'm all done. What'd you do to it? Can you give me a rundown? Whew. Well, first of all, we did a lot of things you can't see. We put a, an amplifier for the stereo. We put in new rear speakers. Oh, awesome. We put in uh, new front speakers to manage with the amplifier. We put in uh, fog lamps. And we did some little accessories. We put some, uh, some lights on it, some lizard lights around it. We put some handle grips on it. Oh, amazing. We did a 12 volt adapter. If you want to have a cigarette lighter, you can have it here. Perfect. We did this nice window. Put it on. Yeah, oh, they're wow. flashing now. You can have them flashing, you can have them on, you can have them change color. What's this here? Oh, this is a voltmeter for the uh, for the motorcycle. So if you put a whole bunch of accessories on, you can make sure you maintain a good oh, charge. That's nice. It lets the rider Very know what clean. the bike's charging at. Yeah. Thanks so much, Larry. Good luck. Okay, thank Take you. Take care. Hey, how you hey. doing? Great, great. Bike looks great. Thank you. How's it going so far? Oh, uh, awesome. Just got done finishing up the chain. So what have you done to it? It looks amazing. Hand guards, heated grips, uh, slip-on exhaust, two tires, and a gold chain. It looks sweet. Yeah. And this little visor there. I like it. It looks, looks fantastic. Yeah. How does she sound? Let's find out. All right. That sounds awesome. Thank you very much. That is it for day two. The builds are done and the bikes are gone. Stay tuned for our next episode where we will reveal each of the completed builds. And in the meantime, let us know in the comments below which one you're most looking forward to seeing.